when you learn, you know, Gol Mashiach, I think it's very important to recognize where we are holding in the scheme of things, right? I think one thing that that I know for myself that I that I see with a lot of people that talk about this thing, they talk about this in Gol Mashiach. They there are people that are in 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 the in the group, so to speak. No, they know that the Rebbe is Mashiach and, they, and all these things, are, they're kaching a Mashiach. But what I think gets lost in translation is that when the Rebbe is saying that where we are now, that we're now holding, right, like the testimony of the Friedrich Rebbe, that we're holding im and kulcham to, to Mikal Vephrei Mashiach Tzadkeinu, that was, that was in Tavshin and Beis. Now we're in Tavshin Pei Dalit. It... We're 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 post all those things. We are now in Yemei Mashiach. We are now. We already have this Galus of Mashiach, like 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 the Rebbe said in in Parshas Vayera. We're post those things, and therefore, where if you understand where you are now, when you learn these things, it becomes so much more gishmak yeah. because these are things that can literally happen in a moment because we're we're in the midst of the process. Right. Yeah, the Rebbe says that you discuss live. Uh, right. You may say it's recorded. You may say Mashiach uh, that we find that you may say Mashiach in which we are in right now. And just to clarify, like uh, you might have explained that there's you may say Mashiach the way uh, the Rebbe is Bechavkas Mashiach and the way is Mashiach Bevadai. So right now the Rebbe is only Bechavkas Mashiach. Although he certainly will be Mashiach. <laughs> it's, not, it's not a doubt. It's, but uh, the technical term, he didn't build the best Mikdash yet in the in in uh, Ben Kemba in uh, in Yerushalayim, and didn't right. keep his Goliath fully yet. But we're still in Yemei Mashiach. That means the Goliath is here. Mashiach is here. So we're in Yemei Mashiach. I, I think unfortunately also, we're still in Goliath. Also, when when you're having a conversation with someone and someone asks you about who Mashiach is and all these things, the reason why it's very important to know who Mashiach is is because you're in. He, there, it, he exists already. He exists as an as Mashiach. Mashiach exists as a person, right? If I told you that there was a person that that is going to be appointed to whatever, and it doesn't matter who he is right now, because right now what's important is to to get yourself ready and to get the world ready and to learn and to become uh, like 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 the mashal that we said to to be good citizens. Okay, then I see why you not necessarily will be important who the king is, but but once you have the king, once the king is on his way, once the king, once the Malach HaMashiach is appointed, once he knows who he is, and not only he knows who he is, yeah. the Rebbe it, said that the Rebbe said that we have this Galas of Mashiach, and not only that, but there's Paulus Hashem Malach HaMashiach. Mashiach is affecting the world. There are things that happen in the things. world. Yeah. Correct. He's doing things right. He's not. It's not like it's not like these are things that that are uh, that are um, that are prophesized in the books about what's going to happen when we get close to the geula. No, no, no. These are things that are when Mashiach comes. Mashiach is going to be doing things and affecting the world in a certain way. Now, even though he's not Mashiach Vadai right now in a full he's, sense, because he's he, the base of Mikdash is not built. He's, He's doing the, the he's starting to do the vadi things. He's he's winning the wars. Exactly. He's, uh, right. He's... When right when does Mashiach become Mashiach Vadai? After he finishes building the base of Mikdash, after he finishes Kibbutz Goliath, or when the process starts? So he becomes Vadai when, when it's pro- finished, but he's 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 doing it. Uh, it's like right. when Moshe Rabbeinu was doing of... the Makis in in Mitzrayim. Right. He was doing things. He 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 was he wasn't just some um, uh, some promise of of a redeemer. He was actively going to Para. He was making Makis. He was, he was getting the Eden ready, and the Eden were rallying behind him, and it was all very exciting. And unfortunately, in that generation, four fifths of the people weren't interested, and they didn't make it out. But in our generation, the Rebbe told us, "Lo yidach mimeno nidach," as Avraham Fried made famous, "No Jew will be left behind." So we got to have everyone on board, everyone excited about this, everybody rallying around the, our King. We got to stop uh, being blind. Oh, we got like the Rebbe said, "Ufaf in the We need to open our eyes. And realize the reality. The Rebbe keep trying to show us the Gula is here, Mashiach is here, but we need to realize it. If we don't realize it, it can't happen. We need to open our eyes.